continue with the ownership here. Thank, no, thank you, thank you. The only member <laughs> of the you. ownership group with a Grammy, I believe. The sweet taste of victory. Grammy You guys winner. know what this feels like, man, right? Absolutely. Oh my God, man. Absolutely. But hard work, obviously. I mean, they, Usher, when they the played buzzer, well. Man. When the buzzer went off, did you dance or sing? <laughs> Both <laughs> at the same time, simultaneously. Have you been on stages before? What's this like compared to what you do? Just being a part of this, winning a championship. Well, I know what it's like to to win a Grammy, but I, I've never known what it's like to have a ring. Which one is better, a Grammy I, I, or a championship I, I, ring? Right now, the ring. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but, man, really happy to be uh, here to celebrate. They worked really hard all year and made history. Yep. You know, that's, the, that's the story that I'm looking forward to, the fact that Cleveland made history. You know? They absolutely did. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. You know what's so crazy? I've been watching you when you came to Hawks games. You've been to basketball fans for so long. You've hung in with this Cleveland Cavaliers organization. Yeah. Just talk about that journey from a youngster now to ownership. To now ring. From Gordon Gunn to Dan Gilbert and his vision and, and all of what Cleveland has been has been. Man, this is this is the story that I mean represents what we are in America. Belief that it can happen. And it did, man. It did. Yeah. It's remarkable. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by.